my beautiful people now welcome back again to my channel i greet on according to na time if not today be your first time here now me be the worry girl for this channel we they talk about the different ethnic groups then when they for nigeria we did that our state now and we they talk about the shakiri ethnic group i beg make you watch this video reach the end like this video and make you see subscribe to my channel so that we go be family so my people i go they talk about some of the stages when they for the termosi traditional marriage right for ishekiri land make you not forget to subscribe after you watch my video i beg make i start to my people the groom's proposal introductory stage the members of the prospective groom's family would make contact with the guest family requesting for an appointment on the appointed day the groom's family would be welcomed and entertained with drinks and cola nuts wedging of cola nuts is not done in ishekiri land if circumstances permit those to be married may not be present the conditions for formalization of marriage are given to the groom at this time upon receipt of the assurance from parents of the bride to be of the marriage to be contracted a promise is given by the family head that will be sent to the family of the groom to be as regards the date of the termosy on the appointed day the families would gather and initial discussions would be about what appellations the akuja that are to be used during the ceremony after the cola nuts and drinks are set on the table the spokesman for the host family would call the appellation which is the akuja of the bride's family and then the groom's family the spokesman then presents gifts to welcome the groom's family who are seen to be on a friendly visit this is typically done in a cordial atmosphere the spokesman for the groom's family would accept the items and thank the host for the welcome accorded them idioms and short stories to sensitize the gathering about the things ahead are usually told by the visiting group at this stage a cola nut is given to the head of the groom's family to break and offer prayers everyone is served drinks after cola nut have been passed around to everyone the groom's family would then reciprocate by presenting various items also to entertain the host family the actual marriage ceremony is then conducted in stages another of the stages is revealing the purpose of the visit which is a more offer bride price is not paid and is also not solicited for research shows that our fathers believe that they cannot be seen to trade with their daughters or give her out in marriage for monetary benefits it is the shekiri belief that the child belongs to god the presentation of emma for the door opener or presentation drink is a major key to the whole ceremony at this stage the groom's family makes their request no that is to have the hand of the woman in marriage and present to cola nuts and a bottle of gin you may want to know why they use cola nuts and drink the two cola nuts must have four cotyledons each making a total of eight cotyledons the number eight is very significant in ishakiri culture it is regarded 
as the number of perfection or completion. In other words, it means the request is properly presented with due respect and regards to the bride's family. The gift items are not accepted until the bride's family is satisfied and the bride's consent is obtained. The groom's family, in a joyous response, will say, We are thankful in Ishekiri language. These actions usually mean that the bride's family has accepted the request and consented to the marriage. So, my people, another of the stage when I go to tell you now, so, nine be the when they say they escort the bride. So many tribes that they do them. But I don't know if your tribe they do them. Let us know if they, they do them or not. That time, the thing they really sweet. Where, where? When they go carry a lot of things, come escort and go to the husband's house. That one they sweet. But me, they not do them for me. Shall, uh -huh. They just do them. That, everything, that day, that day, like that. So it's not quite too sweet like that. So make I take on an enter this other stage i know they go get other stages but this one are the one when i feel get now they tell you now so so when the bride is being escorted songs are usually sung just opposed with e Iwo, I, Iwo. Family usually introduce their family song during marriages the Ologboshere descendant, Isheko Ologboshere, Dare Uwangwe, the royal family of Tonlu, the Ishekiri descendants of Okotomu, Irigbo families, Olomu descendants of Koko, the Yashere families, and Dondo families of Obonte Gareda, all have their family song which are used to this time my people that song when they, they sing follow the bride they sweet well well not be sumo i sabi and sumo for shekiri but i'm not to sabi if i call sigan now they'll come they laugh me uh -huh. so i don't know whether now for every tribe now that they do all this um all these ones you understand if they, they do them for your tradition make you for your culture may you still drop them for the comment section may people know learn from your own side if you be shakiri person you they pass through this video today i beg make you know quiet drop message for dear if you be say get some things when be like say i talk maybe some they not join or maybe some i not talk they finish you physically come put them for dear so that other people when be say they won't learn from you they go learn many things from you and uh, a thing of joy say when anywhere when you day for this world when they just they talk about your tribe or where you come from you get that joy when they day inside person sure you understand so now say just be so when you see where that they talk about your tribe try to they contribute so that the thing when you know past people you go drop and the other people go learn if you see see ma tell you for this channel so many people they learn a lot of things you understand so i go leave on for here next time we'll go talk about another one bye bye mm -hmm.